thank you so much for uh, listening to this success story session where we interview our students who got trained through us who worked with us and then eventually got into this field of data science right and became uh, successful you know data scientists and uh, they they are building a lot of ai solutions in different companies i keep telling that our students work in all the big four companies right the big four companies includes deloitte ernst and young kpmg and uh, power auto scoopers right pwc and uh, we have today with us jiva jiva has successfully cracked and he is now working as a data scientist in en1 which is one of the big four companies thank you so much for providing your time jiva my pleasure okay so jiva can you briefly let us know on what was your educational background and what was your work experience how did you get into this field of data science yeah can you throw some light on that please? great thank you so much for this opportunity garni first of all now i have completed my degree uh, in bsc computer science and i started my career as a, a call center executive so i worked um, in a chennai company for one year long one year after that i realized that uh, that is not my place to work you know i started doing some research to understand like what is my potential and what is the place i have to work then i realized that uh, this is the place i have to work because so uh, when i searched into a data science course like everything so i understood that exactly data science is matching for what i learned in my college also because my i learned college uh, with a background of mathematics statistics and computer science which absolutely matched here also in data science so i thought of this is the exact place i wanted to go so i started uh, are doing research uh, about the data science course i come to know about 360 uh, thankfully like you know i entered into a 360 for training you know it's been wonderful journey like for over there also i have done a course in data science so after that uh, with a god grace i got an opportunity work with 360 itself like i worked in innodatetics for long duration you know it's been amazing uh, journey i got lot opportunities i had very much experience and exposure to work with uh, like sorry, mind i mean a talented people like parani sharath and many more you know i would i would like to say a few things like you know before i'm entering into this big four you know the project which worked like last recent 8 uh, 9 months where helped me really really a lot you know it's not because of the video like i'm saying this for uh, truthfully like here uh, you know we have done a project on wind turbine we have done a project on supply chain management and i'm currently working in ey for supply chain management you know they were also looking for a candidate who have experience in supply chain management like that was exactly the breakthrough point for me to crack into a, a ey job you know i had like i have explained everything what i have done in in that uh, supply chain management project like like approximately 30 minutes over there in the ui interview they were pretty impressed like what i have shared with them so that is uh, exactly where i have given spark to them so i'm really happy i worked with those kind of projects over here and when i'm explaining this wind turbine project to everyone like they are pretty impressed like okay these kind of fields also we can use data science concepts kind of no like they were pretty impressed with those two projects i i specifically wanted to share those two awesome awesome jiva so yeah i i keep telling to people that you know whatever knowledge you have you should start sharing that knowledge as well for the you know benefit of greater community correct and as part of that uh, jiva when we requested you mm-hmm. you readily accepted and uh, you wanted to share your learnings also right and as part of that you worked on projects and you also delivered training so it wasn't a selfish attitude wherein i will work only on projects i'll gain knowledge i'll become selfish i'll get a job uh, high paying sal- with high paying salary um, and then there ends the story you weren't like that right? um, a lot of you all including you you were very kind to actually share your experience and on projects i understand the amount of research and the amount of effort you would have put right and sharing all that knowledge just like that 
with all the you know aspirants who want to get into data science is a big thing right not many people will have the heart to share that's the best part right good uh, jiva i'm extremely happy and thankful to you as well and uh, how do you think the I, i think first you took up that internship role and you worked on the projects you gained some knowledge then you took up the full time uh, role with us right how do you think that internship opportunity actually helped you uh, jiva in in terms of cracking the interview okay so here uh, coming to this internship part you know like we are like there are a lot of companies are giving opportunities to learn you know today's world like everywhere you can learn but the problem is exp- like gathering experience in a real time is getting difficult you know i have gone through some uh, youtube channels also over there like they'll give you projects like whatever already done like for example airbnb kind of those projects were everywhere like these are everyone known projects if i'm going to mention all all of these projects in resume all the expert like already know that these are the like a uh, uh, like everyone's project you no know, these are not the specific projects you know that we uh, break in like when i done a course here I, after that i moved into a project i have done two projects over there those are completely a real world project like when i'm going for an interview i had an opportunity to share that i have worked on these kind of real time projects i can proudly say that i can i have worked i have solved someone's problem in a real time so that's a exact benefit and exact advantage which i got from through the internship so with that only i moved forward as a full time absolutely jiva well said well said we, i mean a lot of uh, training institutes just to get some students conversion right uh, just to have some student pay money and then join they keep saying that we work on real world projects but when you ask them uh, who are the clients what are the names of the customers okay can you can you share a few details they'll be like oh my god <laughs> okay so so that means they are trying to uh, portray a uh, wrong picture uh, falsified information is what they are sharing okay ajiva and final question jiva i'll not pull you back for too long okay. um i i'm sure you want to give a lot of uh, inputs right a lot of feedback and uh, insights into how students who are currently undergoing training or students who have completed training might want to get into this field of data science how should they crack the interviews and all among uh, all those points or suggestions that you want to give can you pick one most important suggestion mm-hmm. on how should the students who are currently undergoing training mm-hmm. or students who have already completed the training how mm-hmm. should they actually get into this field of data science yeah can you can you give that one uh, okay. I, sh- i should say silver bullet kind of a okay. suggestion it's it's very difficult to choose one you know i'll go with two option both are like uh, interrelated okay so here first one you know uh, the first one uh, the patience is very much important you know you thought of doing data science after doing a lot of research you are entered into a course you you have chosen something fine so your patience is most important one first thing and the second one is uh, your process you have to trust your process simple you know i had recently few conversation with few people like everyone is saying that sir i'm i'm unable to crack the interview i'm unable to get interview opportunities i'm kind of frustrated because i'm not getting any opportunities now i would say only one thing you know you're always already entered into a data science field you're already done your course everything you know what is your lagging in your part is your patience and your process you know you have to trust your process keep on applying keep on working on your projects keep on updating your uh, skills that is exactly where you're lagging so that is the exact important point also i believe so first one you have to be very patient and then you have to be very very tr- i mean trust worthy person on your process like you have to like you have to completely trust on your process what you are doing why you are doing and like what is your goal exactly where you wanted to land you have to focus only on those things apart from this these, these negative points you know i'm not uh, uh, getting those much opportunities no you will get one opportunity right for sure you will get one opportunity right for that one opportunity you have to give your 200 percent that is my simple answer so, absolutely jiva i mean this is very inspiring yeah the mm-hmm. one key point that you have told is keep preparing yourself you will yes. get that one opportunity yes and crack it exactly okay that is the most important thing and perseverance yeah faster you think 
as long as you have perseverance you will flourish yes yeah. you are no, having known you and having known your attitude uh, i'm 100% certain you will flourish in your life you will flourish in your career i have no second thought on that right thank so yes. thank you thank you so much you are you were saying something sorry ah uh, no 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 i was you know recently I gone through some instagram post i have come across with this post i am not sure this is true or false but i heard this okay you know there is a uh, there is a person in a cricket like recently he is a most popular person in cricket i don't want to share his name specifically okay you know there is a news that he said something like that okay you know you can lose any match you can lose as many match you wanted to but not your final not on your final not yours not ah, on your final okay. <laughs> so you can lose as many match you wanted to there is no one will ask you question but not on your final so you have to crack on your final that is the only target so true, true. don't well said well said <laughs> that's it yeah. okay jiva thank you so much for your time true, true. see you Anytime, sir. when i'm in <laughs> bengaluru probably we can catch it sure i'm i'm always Bye. ready yeah. thank you varun